Have you ever tried Captain Morgan's cream soda cocktail? Does it taste like cream soda? Is it any good? Let's find out. My name is David Edwards and this is Booze Under Rocks. We're going to make Captain Morgan's cream soda cocktail. Now this comes directly off the bar.com. However, I'm going to make a slight change in the way I prepare it. Not by much, it's just because I think it should be shaken rather than just dropped in a glass and stirred. But before we get involved with that, let's talk about the spirit and the liqueur that we're going to use. Our first spirit is Captain Morgan's Original Spiced Rum. It's 35% ABV and produced in the US Virgin Islands. Our liqueur is Mager's Triple Sec. It's an orange liqueur, it's 35% ABV and produced in Toronto, Ontario. Now this is a simple three ingredient cocktail plus a little bit of lime for the garnish. Now the recipe on the website actually calls to be put into a glass and stirred. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to shake it because there is alcohol and there is juice in it and it'll give us a nice smooth fluffy texture. So this is my way of one-upping it a little bit. But we're going to start with your triple sec. Now this is an orange liqueur and we're going to start with a quarter of an ounce or seven and a half mils. Now our next ingredient is our spiced rum and as the title says it's Captain Morgan's. So what we'll do is we'll just pop the lid for this and we're going to use a total of one ounce or 45 milliliters. Now your third ingredient is pineapple juice. And I'm using a pure pressed pineapple juice. There's no sugar added, there's no pulp, but you can use whatever you want. It's your cocktail. We're gonna use two ounces or 60 milliliters. Now we're almost there. However, the, what I said I would do is I'm going to shake this. And the reason I'm shaking this is just, it'll combine everything a little bit better and it'll chill it and give us a little bit of dilution. We don't need a lot, but we only need to shake this for a good, maybe eight to 10 seconds. So what you wanna do, slap your lid on really, really well, make sure you have a good seal. Give it a flip and shake it with a smile. Yeah. Pop that off with the strength of a thousand pineapples, spiced pineapples that is. And what we will do is we will put this in a tall glass, just like on the website. And we're just gonna use some regular cubed ice because, you know, use whatever you got. Now, the other thing we're going to do is we are going to fine strain this and it's only to keep out the little ice crystals. Oh, look at that. Absolutely gorgeous to look at. A nice pale yellow, a little bit of silky smoothie foaminess. So what you're gonna do, grab your straw, put that in there, then grab your lime, cut it in half, and then cut a nice little wedge. And what we'll do is we'll just put that on top. This looks fantastic, it's a nice pale yellow. Let's try it out. Mm. It's good, you've got the pineapple, you've got the rum with those spices and just a hint of the orange liqueur because that's all you put in. Is it good? Yes. Does it taste like cream soda? No. But if you want a really good pineapple flavored cocktail that's tropical in nature, look over here and grab the Hawaiian Slammer. It's a fantastic cocktail I know you're gonna love. 